What up? It's Ironclad coming at you from sunny Southern California. Just at the farmer's market this morning and got my first batch of persimmons. Got some fuyu and some hachia and uh, also some tomatoes, some oranges, but I'm really stoked for persimmons. Uh, I tasted one that was unripe, just like a chunk that they had for samples and it was so good. These are like farm fresh, locally grown organic persimmons. <laughs> they're so good when they're ripe, they're just going to be awesome. Um, but uh, wanted to make a video for you guys. I've been trying to churn out the videos because it's really been helping me. I've been uh, going through some t tough times to say the least. Uh, first couple months of chiropractic school has been tough. Just to give you an idea, we pretty much learn everything that medical students learn, minus the, the pharmacology, drugs, and stuff, and then we learn, you know, chiropractic techniques. So it's been it's been intense. And, uh, you know, I've, I've had some struggles, like studying all weekend for a test and then coming in and thinking you got an A on it and then finding out you got a D on it. And uh, it's definitely taken some mental fortitude to uh, just stay positive and, you know, keep your head up and not dwell too much on mistakes and stuff like that. And I think that's where, you know, the diet and the exercise and the meditation really come in handy. I've been pretty much... You know, meditating every day, exercising every day, although I might take a day off from exercise today because my back is kind of sore. But uh, it's really helped to stay positive because, man, I was like, being in last week, I think I had a D in two classes, and I was just like, oh, what am I doing? What am I doing? And then I had to use the Cartman voice and be like, oh, no, I got a D on a quiz. Oh, no. Oh, no, I'm going to fail out of the school. Oh, no, life is so hard. Life is such a struggle, oh my god. And, um, you know, persevered and, uh, got a few good grades on a couple of tests this week. Got my grades up, which I'm really happy about. But, you know, a lot of people are struggling. One girl almost had, like, a nervous breakdown in the middle of class. And then one other dude was, like, asking a few of us, he's like, do you just keep asking yourself, like, how am I going to get through this? And I thought about that question. And I said, no, I keep telling myself I'm going to get through this. And it was just sort of like one of those profound things that came to mind, like that positive mental attitude. And he's like, dude, that is such a good answer to that question. And I thought to myself, yeah, no, I'm so awesome, yeah. But, uh, you know, sometimes when things are going bad, it can seem like, you know, just the world's going to end and things are just going to continue the way they are. And you're just totally fucked and uh you gotta step back and look at the bigger picture and say hey you know what maybe i got a, a c or a d on this one quiz here but it doesn't mean that i'm gonna you know do that on the next one and bring my grade up with an a or a b and if i just if I worry about it and if i'm in a bad emotional state it's like doesn't matter anything so if i want to improve i gotta you know just persevere keep that positive mental attitude and um, take my licks and keep going and not dwell on the past and stay grounded in the present moment. So I just wanted to give you guys a little perspective on what I have been dealing with lately. I've got a bunch more video ideas that I want to do and when I have some time I'm going to crank them out. I love you guys. Thank you so much for watching and I'll catch you next time.